The atmosphere in an enclosed space may contain any one or of the following characteristics. Number one, it could be oxygen deficient, that is lack of oxygen. Number two, it could be oxygen enriched, that is excess of oxygen. Number three, the atmosphere may contain flammable gases or vapors. And number four, there could be the presence of toxic gases or vapors. Well, if a space was found to be initially safe, such a space may become dangerous due to the presence of atmosphere becoming unsafe on later stage. Not only that, the unsafe atmosphere may also be present in spaces adjacent to any declared and close space. IMO resolution A105027 defines and close space. Well, A stands for assembly, 1050 is the serial number and 27th was the session. Resolutions are the finalized document which are accepted by the IMO or any other main body under IMO. They generally result from an agreement on a recommendation or amendment. Now let's talk about the definition and any space which has the following characteristics is called enclosed space. The limited openings for entry and exit, inadequate ventilation and the space which is not designed for continuous worker occupancy. The UK regulations also define dangerous space that any enclosed or confined space in which it is foreseeable that atmosphere may at some stage contain toxic or flammable gases or vapors or be deficient in oxygen to the extent that it may endanger the life or health of any person entering that space. The list of enclosed space includes cargo space, double bottoms, fuel tanks, ballast tanks, cargo pump rooms, cargo compressor room, coffer dams, chain lockers, wide spaces, duct keels, inter-barrier spaces, boilers, engine crank cases, engine scavenge air receivers, sewage tanks, and the adjacent connected spaces. Of course, this list is not complete. Some spaces may be dangerous, a space only temporarily, perhaps due to the type of cargo carried or work to be undertaken, for example, a compartment during a spray painting. So a list should be produced by ship staff on ship to ship basis, identifying the enclosed space. It is recommended that an inventory is made of any enclosed spaces that seafarers may enter where there is any possibility that they might become dangerous. The inventory should record the characteristics of the space, the likely hazard and measures to prevent entry unless safety procedures are followed.